Hey, Tracy Lewis from Stuff and Things. My husband commented on the bright orange sunset, so I'm gonna take you guys on a walk down to the lake. Here's our spot, totally loaded with oak leaves and acorn nuts on the ground that you can hear popping as you walk. Oh, somebody else is already watching the sun sunset too. Look at that. So that's the lake right there. It's a little after five here. All of these trailers are seasonal people or annual people, all five. So there's like no neighbors. We are the closest people to the lake. and here's the lake. It's about 70 degrees right now at five o'clock. If we were at home in the fall, walking through fall leaves on the ground, it would be like 40 degrees and pouring down rain. So this is our wonderful view. I can actually stare out at this view from my window when I'm working away. And then the ground, See if you can see all the nuts. Look at all those acorn nuts. They're everywhere and they pop because the tops pop off. Very cool. I don't even recall in our state of Washington, we have maple trees in abundance. Like this is actually, I'm gonna turn around now and you can see the campground is, this is like a oak grove. It's very cool. It's very idyllic. It is Sunday and we have a person doing some construction. You can hear it in the background, but it's not too bothersome. But this is what we're here for. Awesome views, nice mild weather. This is a much nicer lake to me than Lake Whitney, which is more um, steep with lots of dirty sides with the different heights of the water where this is obviously budding right up to, to you know, grass land. And there is a little bit here, a lip, where you can see they must let the reservoir get to a certain height. Because there's the, kind of the, the farthest the water comes in. I just heard a bird. There's lots of herons and these little black birds. We have beaver. At night, my husband likes to be nocturnal and walk around at night, and he gets lots of tail slaps in the water, telling him to go away. And there's even this right over here, going back in on the other side of the grove is a marina, and you can see a awesome little dirt and stick hut that the beavers have created. But I just wanted to share this with you. Oh, look, the sun is going behind the clouds. I thought you guys might like to see this. And uh, then also my when I get this posted, the family at home can see it and see all the fun that they are missing. Thanks for watching.